Welcome back, Pat Streaker6 with the Hilo Hounds. Earlier today, WAGS put out a video fielding questions about DCS World performance improvements that are already here and those that are coming in the future. If you would like to watch the original video, I have it linked in the description below. He talked about multi-threading and how it has greatly improved performance for a large amount of the community and is apologetic to those that it has not helped. The focus on multi-threading this year was optimizing performance to the graphics layer, so the logic layer will be optimized in the future, but not likely any time this year. When the Vulkan API is introduced, it will originally be for multi-platform rather than performance. FSR 2 and 3 also rely on the Vulkan API or DirectX 12, which ED does not use and have no intentions of using at this time. So for now, FSR 1 is all we have when it comes to FSR. Frame generation will be introduced at a later time with updates to DLSS. And that's pretty much it in a nutshell for updates to performance. Please continue watching as Wags summarizes it for you in his own words. I think probably one of the big takeaways from this video is that performance is not just a single effort. It's divided between multi-threading, graphics layer, logic layer, DLSS, FSR, a Vulkan, uh, engine performance, and probably have other different optimizations. It's just not a single effort. And all of those continue in parallel at the same time. So will performance improve? Undoubtedly. Oh.